Let's apply that formula which we have discussed for finding out the radius of convergence of power series to certain examples. So we are going to discuss certain example and we are going to find out the radius of convergence for those power series. So examples, three examples we are going to discuss and we are going to find out the radius of convergence for that power series. The first one is summation x raised to power n over n factorial. Here we have a n equals 1 over n factorial. Okay. And this power series is about x naught equals 0. That's why aapka x raised to power n. So what we have learned, we have learned that 1 over r equals limit n approaches to infinity a n plus 1 over a n absolute value. We have to consider that limit. So a n plus 1 will be 1 over n plus 1 factorial and a n will be 1 over n factorial. So this ratio a n plus 1 over a n will be 1 over n plus 1 factorial into n factorial and it turns out to, to be 1 over n plus 1. Yaan pe maine kya use ki hai? Ke n factorial jo hai, ye n minus 1 factorial into n ke equal hota hai. Is ye formula jo hai, maine use ki hai. So this ratio. Ab is ratio ki maine limit jo hai, n approaches to infinity consider karni hai. So whenever this limit n approaches to infinity hogi, so this limit will be 0. Radius of convergence of that power series, wo kya hota hai? Is limit ka 1 over r. So r will be, radius of convergence will be 1 over 0. And 1 over 0 kya hota hai? Infinity. So this power series converges throughout the real numbers. Ye yaan pe calculate kya hai. So radius of convergence r equals infinity aya. Therefore, r equals infinity, that is the series converges for all x belongs to real numbers, extended real numbers in fact. Determine the radius of convergence for that series. Yaan pe aapka a n jo hai, ye n factorial hai. So ratio will be n plus 1 over a n limit n approaches to infinity. That will be n plus 1 factorial divided by n factorial. That will be n plus 1. Now limit agar mein leta hon, that is infinity. So 1 over infinity jo ke radius of convergence hota hai, that will be 0. So that series converges only at x equals 0 jo ke yehi maine explain kiya hua hai. We have this limit aur yeh sub limit evaluate karke infinity hai. Radius of convergence jo hota hai, iska 1 over r hota hai. So we have r equals 0. It means x equals 0 pe sirf yeh jo hai power series converge karegi. Ye example jo hai, ye thodi si interesting example hai and you, you have to be careful while dealing with that example. Is mein n ki jo marzi value ho, you will always have x raised to power 2n. Is ka matlab hai, x ki hamesha even power hogi. So, the power series contains infinite many zeros. Even power si raf aayengi, is ka matlab hai, odd power wali jo x ki powers hain, unka coefficient kya hai? Zero hai. So, pehli observation ye hai ke for that power series, jis ke liye a n jo hai, n a term jo hai, minus 1 raised to power n over 4 n, n raised to power p hai, aur p a me constant, koi bhi constant diya gaya hai, is me infinite many zeros jo hai, wo hai. Thik hai? The given power series has, has infinitely many zero coefficients of odd powers of x. So, we have to make a trick. What is that trick? We take y equals x square. If I take this one, then my this power series will, will turn out to be coefficient to yehi rehega. y raised to power n ho jayegi. Ab is mein infinite many series wale jo hai, uh, infinite many terms which have coefficient 0, us tarah ki koi baat nahi hai. However, by setting y equals x square, we obtain this series which has non-zero coefficients for which Hum calculate kar sakte hai, limit n approaches to infinity a n plus 1 divided by a n. Isko calculate kiya. Ye simple uh, calculation hai which turns out to be 1 over 4 limit n approaches to infinity 1 plus 1 over n sare ki power minus p. Jab iski limit mein evaluate karunga that, that will be 1 over infinity jo hai ye 0 hota hai. 1 ki power minus p, p is any constant jo marzi value ho, that will always be 1 over 4. For the so, the radius of convergence for that 
सीरीज विच इज गिवन इन टू इसका वन ओवर आर दिस लिमिट होता है लिमिट एन अप्रोचेस टू इंफिनिटी ए एन प्लस वन ओवर ए एन सो रेडियस ऑफ कन्वर्जेंस फॉर पावर सीरीज गिवन इन टू इज फोर अब वाई जो था इक्वल्स एक्स स्क्र था उसको हम यूटिलाइज करके देर फोर टू कन्वर्जेस इफ वाई मॉड लेस देन फोर ओ एंड डाइवर्जेस इफ वाई मॉड ग्रेटर देन फोर ओ सेटिंग वाई इक्वल्स एक्स स्क्र वी विल हैव द सीरीज फर्स्ट सीरीज जो ओरिजिनल हमारी सीरीज थी दैट विल कन्वर्ज इफ एक्स मॉड लेस देन टू एंड डाइवर्जेस इफ एक्स मॉड ग्रेटर देन टू वॉट अबाउट एट द एंड पॉइंट हमने डिस्कस किया हुआ है रेडियस ऑफ कन्वर्जेंस निकालने से आपका जो इंटरवल ऑफ कन्वर्जेंस आता है हमने ये एग्जाम्पल्स भी डिस्कस की थी कि एट द एंड पॉइंट ऑफ दैट इंटरवल सीरीज मे बी कन्वर्जेंट मे बी डाइवर्जेंट अब ये जो एग्जाम्पल लास्ट एग्जाम्पल हमने डिस्कस की है इसके एंड पॉइंट क्या आ रहे हैं एक्स इक्वल टू एंड एक्स इक्वल माइनस टू अगर एक्स इक्वल टू जो है ये हम कंसिडर करें पावर सीरीज जो थर्ड एग्जाम्पल में हमने किया सीरीज बिकम्स दिस फॉर्म सुमेशन माइनस वन रेज टू पावर एन ओवर एन रेज टू पावर पी इस सीरीज को हमने डिस्कस किया हुआ है डिटेल्ड जिसको हार्मोनिक सीरीज भी मैं कहता था दिस सीरीज कन डाइवर्जेज इफ पी इज लेस देन इक्वल टू वन एंड कन्वर्जेज कंडीशनली इफ पी इज बिटवीन जीरो एंड वन और पी अगर ग्रेटर देन वन हो तब ये कन्वर्ज करती है क्योंकि ये ऑल्टरनेटिंग सीरीज है माइनस वन रेज टू पावर एन ओवर एन पी है इस सीरीज को हमने डिटेल डिस्कस किया हुआ है so it strengthen our that remark in which i have stated that the interval at the end points of the interval of convergence the series may be convergent may be divergent it is about the power series